Arthur. Hey, Arthur! Hey! Oh. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Hey, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? Oh, sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses already. <sighs> you gonna take the old man into town? You take us, too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. and you're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on, then. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment to civilization. <laughs> Ladies are going to love it. Sure, you'll see. Real civilized. <laughs> Let's go. All right. You know the way? Yeah. Me and the boys got into a bit of a fight at the saloon there. <laughs> Already? Ooh, so all that talk about how hard you've been working. You mean drinking? <laughs> Easy. Yeah. Lady, give us a song. Town. Yes, 
you help that poor man? Oh, Lombago! It's very serious. It can be deadly. How about you, Arthur? Do I look like I got the energy to waste on charity? That fool can get his own horse. I don't believe you're quite that cold, Mr. Morgan. Oh, I'm colder than you realize. I feel bad I didn't rob and kill the bastard. <laughs> Very inspiring, Arthur. Woo! Smell those sheep. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Go left here, down the main street. Sheriff's always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. All right. Here we are, just like I said. The cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're gonna do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. We're in Paris. Come on. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then... Rats with the plague, then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Morning. So, what do you need? Drop a whiskey for a start. Well, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Yeah. That guy should probably steer clear of the saloon this time. You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Let me know if you have any questions, fellers. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Wait, ain't you the feller who had the fight with Tommy outside the saloon? Yeah, that all got a little out of hand, but I didn't swing first. <laughs> sure, well, these things happen. And that was some good viewing. Don't reckon folk ever seen Tommy lose a fight before. Well, it's all done now. You not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. What do you really mean? Lamb or the sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. I don't know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a ripe cheap. Okay, if you're done, I'll meet you outside. I won't be too long. So, you're actually buying for once? You feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. All done. Thank you kindly. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. All the best, fellers. Trying to stay out of trouble now. to your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. 
This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house, acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out there in New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me! Get off of me! Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? You wanna find out? You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you. Go right wait now. with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. Can I help you, sir? No trouble now, please! Sorry. Wrong room. Ugh. Hey! Who are you? A friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I paid. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here! What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him. Not very well. You okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched uh, me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. All right, then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get! I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Oh, God. Leave out. Just following it. You stay away from me! Get back here right now! Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. 
I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. <laughs> now please pull me up. Please. I'm begging you. <clears throat> All right. Come on. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Jimmy Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh, here, you want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Oh, that's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding? Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one cent. In this year old mind. Come on. Come on. You have a nice day now, sir. Back, friend. Oh, you really were just borrowing it. What the hell did I ever do to you? What is your problem? Why have you got it in for me? God damn it, I just want to go home. each other it's not about survival of the fittest uh, never... <laughs> oh it's you <clears throat> look out please be generous oh, be generous time, mister Look out, mister. Sit on down and lose some money. Gambling sure beats working, most days. My old lady's gonna string me up for losing this money. Appreciate it. Mm. 
That's good. I reckon so. Check. I don't think. Yeah, I'll check. I'll check. Should have stopped four shots ago. Yeah. I'll uh, check. Check. No. Uh, -uh. Uh, uh. Uh. Huh. Take a look at my luck. Damn. Couldn't even sell these cards. Have a look at uh. these. This ain't no good, huh? Shit. Uh. Uh. Woo! -wee! Big time. Mm-hmm. Yep. I've been waiting dang near a month for the dry goods I ordered. Let me see. Huh? Check for me. Check. I'll raise you. Huh? Let's make this exciting. Hey, hey, what do you know? Get a load of these here. Well, looky oh, here, shit. friend. Damn you, stupid game. Oh, good lord, I won! Dang it, we doing fine. You, you're lucky. Do appreciate it. <clears throat> nope. <laughs> I don't know about that one. I'll check. Check a thing. Nah. Raise me on up. You play like hmm. a kid.
I'm going raise. Raise me on up. I'm calling. Excuse me. Send a better player, will you? So, ain't that pretty oh, good? I'll tell you. Uh, shucks. Place uh, well, it's okay, something. Dang. Hello there. Uh, wouldn't have killed all them red Don't think I've seen you here before. Uh, Welcome. You. Hey, mister. One buffalo, about anything. one redskin. I shot 19 of them once. Well, buffalo, not redskins. Don't know how many redskins oh, killed, you. Really? but they deserved it. They weren't Christians, so I said. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, pick it. No respect. That's something else. No use arguing against it. So fast. Oh my God. What the hell? Oh. Oh, I'm calling for the law. Sorry, mister. It's on the line. Help! Please! Someone! Oh my God! Do this. This ain't happening. Someone help.
Oh, God, no. God damn it! I know your type. Keep moving. I'll have nothing to do with you. Trail. No damn time for you. Good boy.
Hello, Arthur. Please. Speak! Don't cry, boy. Speak! About your gang. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> boy. Whoa! Hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit! You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah! Uh, <laughs> who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Uh -huh. Geld him. Oh, yeah! <laughs> What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, you're kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastards! Oh, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up, and you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Oh. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you, no offense. Oh, none taken. <laughs> okay then, partner. Uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. Well, you sure as shit was. John, Phil, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, kill him. You're gonna pay your buddies our respect. He taking us to Cold? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right. I'll leave. In front of you. All right! Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like... God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might... I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey. Hey. If, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah. I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Tell me what the O'Driscoll smelled like before you asked me to ride with him. That's because you wasn't asked to ride with us. You was told. Well, I smell like a stall ain't been cleaned out in a month. I smell like that because you had me tied up there about as long. You'd be smelling worse if we'd done what some was arguing for. Granted, granted, I was in with a bad lot. I'm trying to make amends, if I can. You don't know the half. I do know Colm killed Dutch's sweetheart. And that's the man you chose to ride with. A woman killer. Well, it was after he killed his brother. And the way I understood it, the... Uh... Making excuses for the man. And his crimes. What kind of trap you leading us into, boy? I ain't. I'm trying to help, honest. One thing goes wrong. One thing other than you smelling funny, 
You're the first O'Driscoll will shoot. <sighs> now we go left. The uh, road will take us up and round. Save your horses! We gotta climb, boys! You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this game. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them, you're out to survive like them, you live rough, you live hard, fighting the law, nature, you're out for yourselves. See, this is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive, we're out to live, free. Colm's a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is, Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boys, we're almost on him. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fight. Here and now. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Whoa! Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Come on. Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you, strangers? Yep. From Cormo Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm, yes, sir. Come on, shake it off. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. He's yours, Williamson. Okay. Me. I got him. <gasps> We're here. We don't need nothing else from you.
that's the plan. Let's get close to these two. Make no mistakes here. When we're there, we move at the same time. We're waiting. You lost your mind. <laughs> On the camp, I left our guide up there. He's meek as a little lamb. He better be. Down around the log. What are we doing about him? This one's mine. We need it done right. Go on and show us then. What are we doing? Driscoll's! Glad to see ya! Guys in the camp! Look out! What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here. He was here, I swear. I swear. I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. Get lost. Get lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. 
Out there, without you, Como just was gonna lose his mind about this. So? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp, quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. <laughs> right you are. At least you got something tucked away. Long time, boy.
doing back here? Ain't you caused enough trouble? Huh? Beating up half the saloon like that? Near... Come on, there's gotta be a fight every night in that shithole. Just show some respect next time. We run far worse than you out of town before. Oh, come on, man. Someone throws a punch, you punch back. Don't bother pretending different. Back off! As far as I care, you ain't even here. Problem. I'm real hungry What's here. What's your problem? Hey, buddy. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? <sighs> sure. I'm so happy. I ain't had a friend in a long time. Long, long time. My last friend died. Weren't my fault. They said it was, but they was wrong. It's fun being with you, mister. Can I hold you a second, mister? Can I? Okay, just quickly. That felt good. It's nice to be held sometimes. Well, we used to hold each other in the war. You got sad eyes, mister. Like you've seen sad things. Remember with kindness. Oh.
Hey, mister. Hmm. We got a long way to go, huh? <laughs> I asked my boys here if they would help their pa build a, a new house. Thought I'd teach them a few things, you know? Couldn't hammer a nail to save their lives. Ain't that right, Curtis? Whatever you say, Paul. All the best. You... Look out! Arthur. Easy. You don't worry about your soul. You probably don't even have them. You're like animals. You're free. Me, I'm in torment. I'm in hell. I am a failure in every conceivable way. The morphia has me by the throats, and its embrace is brutal. The whiskey wants to drown me, and God won't let me go either. I can't stand it. It's tearing at me. <laughs> I used to be a man of God. But now look at me. I'm just a wretch. And worse than that, a self-pitying one. <laughs> So, you and the girls got back all right? Yeah. How'd you get on with that fellow who ran off on you? It's dealt with. Anyway, I won't disturb you. All right, Arthur. All good there, Pearson? Still need more food, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, you should try your luck again with that bow. I know, I will. Hello, Bill. Well, I have plenty to do here.
Arthur. Dutch, Miss O'Shea. Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. They don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! Uh, What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. <sighs> they nearly lynched me. They... They got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. <sighs> I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Mike has got a crazy side off it. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting ahead for us. to some fellas, one of them Micah knew, drank some more, and this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you gonna go get them? I'll come with you. No, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mike. It was drink that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down and head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. Here we are. Just one or two, right, off Of course, just a drink. Don't be dumb. Can we get a couple of beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Mike... A lot Mikey... of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, they're dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> <laughs> and leave this fool alone. 
Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone for the last ten years. I'm bored with being left alone. Hey, buddy, if you don't shut up, I'm gonna rip your head clean off your shoulders. Is that clear? Get out of here! Clear? Clear? Very clear. I'm on my way. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> That's great, partner. Lenny, Lenny, where are you? your mouth, mister.
Lenny. Lenny, stop slumping off on me! What? I Lenny. Degenerates. Oh. There's a fine for drunken violence in this town. You're just lucky no one was killed. Hey, we didn't start a thing. <laughs> yes, you did. Well, I don't remember. Either you fools got any money, it's $10 and you're free to walk. Sure. Now, get out of here. I don't want to see either of you around here no more. Quiet drink. First one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind off goddamn Mikey. Well, that's certainly true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna have a little sit down. Feel sorry for myself. Oh. 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 